through the belly of the internet. It's a vast data center, and we've had to come through a number of levels of security to get here. Um, and it really stores all the vast amounts of data that we all put online these days. Let's go and have a look inside. Two things you need to know about these data centers. They need a lot of energy and they create a lot of heat. So the energy here comes from a nearby hydroelectric dam, but there's backup. There are generators, there are also these batteries that can uh, be switched on if the power from outside goes down. And then all those banks of servers, they create an awful lot of heat, they need cooling down. So you've got a, a refrigeration unit here, one of three that keeps the place cool. So this is the heart of a data center. It's a server room. It's one of 10 giant server rooms uh, at this particular center with as many as 30,000 servers in each of them. Obviously a vast amount of computing power, an awful lot of storage, and all part really of this big ramping up of, of cloud computing. Uh, and here's Mike Manos uh, from Microsoft. You run the data center operation. Mike, just give us a sense of the scale. Uh, how much can be stored in a place like this? Well, I did a little calculations, and if we apply it to something that everyone likes to do, which is storing pictures up on the Internet, uh, this facility or a facility of this size could house somewhere in the neighborhood of 6.75 trillion photos for, for the users of, of our cloud applications. So just about every photo in the world, uh, and an awful lot of search and uh, instant messaging, all sorts of other applications. That's correct. Uh, across the breadth of our cloud computing platform, we have instant messaging, email storage systems, pictures, video, all of those services, products and services, are served out of facilities just like these all across the planet. Now, people will be worried about a couple of things. They'll be worried about security um, in terms of people getting hold of their data. They'll be worried about what happens if a place like this shuts down. Well, from a security perspective and from a redundancy perspective, a facility like this is, is pretty hardened. Uh, as you probably saw as you came in, security is pretty tight on the outside. Uh, logically, in terms of getting access to your data, we have pretty significant security measures deployed to protect the users. If the facility were to go down, if there was a catastrophic event, for, for example, uh, we have the ability in our application software, in our cloud infrastructure, to fail all of this over to other facilities. So you'll never have an issue of not being able to get to your data wherever you happen to be from. Okay, Mike, thank you very much. So that's, uh, that's one data center part of this huge battle developing in the clouds between the likes of Microsoft, Google and Amazon uh, to take us future into the future of cloud computing.